Okay, this is a quick video. It's about the Make Sky Blue MPPT multi point power tracking 60 amp AMP solar charge controller. Make Sky Blue Shenzhen Technology Co. Limited, made in China. Shenzhen, that's a huge technological uh, Chinese port city. Uh, it's known as the uh, Silicon Valley of China. So, this may be the future of charge controllers. So, stay tuned on that. 60 amp. And this is a, an older charge controller I've had, the EcoWorthy 20 amp. This thing. This thing finally uh, went wonko because I had it under load and I was moving some wires and now it can't detect the proper current. It's still working but it's not working the way it's intended. It, it can't detect the current and so it can't, it, until, it, until it detects current it can't adjust this multi-point uh, power tracking and so it basically it's shot. This is shot but I brought this for comparison. When I open this thing up we'll see. My first time opening it, nice. It's just a uh, flap in the back. Open it up. We'll go through the manual qu quick. I always put the manuals if I can. Super glossy paper. So I think you can get this one from the website also. Um, we'll go through that real quick. Now I've been a big fan of the Intronix uh, 75 blah 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 American uh, made out of imported parts uh, MPPT charge controller but they all sold out. They were like 288 bucks on eBay and they all sold out so I went with this one. Um, it's about $150 or so shipped uh, I watched all the videos on YouTube I could find and in one of them the guy goes like ah like zap zap the guy he got shocked so I don't know and then other people are complaining they're not grounded properly so uh, I will say I don't know I don't know um, I'm gonna be real careful when I handle it though so they come with uh, some brackets here that's good and I, when I, oh, when I held into the box, I noticed it was pretty heavy for, I didn't think it'd be so heavy. You would expect it to be like a Kleenex box, you know, like really light, but it's not. So, it's got some weight to it. Pull it out. And then other people have commented that there's a blue plastic on there. Just supposed to take it off. Okay, so here's the terminals. Nice, nice. That is an upgrade uh, compared to these, which are kind of tricky. This is better right here. These are better. It's a better deal. And then, you know, you just tighten them down. Okay. So let's do the size comparison. See that? Does that help? Does it help you? Hopefully. Okay, let's do the uh, that six for sixty amp. So um, you can kind of see in there. It's got those. Uh, it's I saw. Uh, I saw a video, or sorry, a picture of one of these opened up, and those are the coils, the copper, copper coils for the uh, true MPPT. There's three of them in that picture, but this is pretty heavy. This 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 thing is heavy for its size. 
I mean, unexpectedly so. This thing, mm, not so heavy. Um, so that was a shocker. <laughs> not like, zah! Not like that shocker, but shocker as in, it's heavy. Um, so, some people have complained that they're not grounded. Um, and whatever. Just be careful. Be super careful. Super careful. Um, the other thing to look for, CE. Some people like, uh, misinterpolate this as uh, European certification or certification Europe. Europe. There's also another one that looks very similar that actually stands for China Export. Like the the characters are farther apart and that's how they fool a lot of folks. So I don't know if that's a CE European certification <laughs> which is uh, you know <laughs> or it's the Chinese export. And so that's something to think about. So this is a budget charge controller. It's probably using some reverse engineered uh, Western tech and it's been reconfigured to a inexpensive um, MPT charge charge solar charge controller and or it may have original uh, never before seen technologies developed in Sinjin uh, so who knows I'm not an expert on that somebody hopefully is but um I wish I could get in there but I don't have the tools or the time right now I could look at the boards and things but yeah I'll have to fire it up and we'll see um projects I'm working on you can see uh, this little little preview little tip little hint mm -hmm. does that help you out see what I'm gonna be doing here maybe if you know what I do my other videos just, just kind of help you out a little bit a little preview but uh yeah so make sky blue um sounds like a good plan so my opinion is back in the day way way back chinese goods were the supreme spectacular super duper stuff we're talking silk we're talking uh china uh, where we eat off it the plates and stuff um we're talking uh all kinds of stuff it was the uh the silk road uh, stuff out of china was premium grade and they could easily go back to that standard they just got a quick cut cutting corners and when they do it's going to shock the global market because uh, they have the capability of making premium goods quicker better cheaper and faster than anyone so they may actually be in that mid transition where they're actually transitioning to top quality because they know they get a better price for that and less problems and better reputation and, and better sales actually you know repeat business if it works out good so uh, just judging from that, this may be that point in time where they're actually working on quality control and they're actually going to have a product that uh, blows everybody out of the water because no one can beat the the cost uh, per production scale that they've got. They've got government subsidies, they've got uh, workers that will work for uh more efficiently than anywhere else and etc etc so anyway i think this video is going to end at 10 minutes so we got to see but yeah um let's see how this works when i get it going i'm going to get it going here shortly i am condemned with more finals at university but once that's done we're going to get on the real world stuff the stuff i care about which is renewable energy and this is straight out of the renewable energy Sinjin Silicon Valley Chinese capital 
oh it's past 10 minutes well I could go a little bit more farther um, so you're gonna have the attachment screws and you're gonna have the brackets right and they're gonna probably hook on right there and right there and so it makes you wonder if you leave the blue plastic on will it you not get shocked in that case it'd be worth it because it's still ventilated it's, it's, it's there's holes and stuff opened up maybe I should leave the plastic on it's just, it's just an extra extra um, safety thing of course I don't know if they all shock or that was just a freak wiring on that one video you'll find it. if you watch it we put a make sky blue and watch all of them you'll find the one I'm talking about the guys like Zah! <laughs> so anyway okay all right well let's let's finish this up all right I know look here let me help you out let me let me creep up on here yeah look at that mm -mm -mm. maybe you know what that means I'll tell you in a new, new video mm-hmm yeah okay well I'm super interested in getting those going I'll tell you I tell you all right so anyway if this works out good uh, it works out good so there you go make sky blue Make sky blue.